So we may not appreciate what's so grandiose about a setting point of star. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala then brings a verse just to emphasize that if you knew what it meant, you would appreciate why taking an oath of the setting point of star has value. So taking an oath on the setting point of stars signifies their perishability and highlights divine power. Because if a star sets, which means it goes away from our sight, yeah, and that is something that it cannot control. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had made it go into its orbit, and it has no power upon itself. Similarly, we have no power upon anything around us either. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala emphasizes the greatness of his oath in this verse, that if you could imagine the magnitude of this oath, we would understand how important is the purpose of this oath, which will come in the next verse. Indeed, the whole cosmic system, including our galaxy and solar system, are a huge sign of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's power. The motion of stars and their orbits, their setting and rising, have lessons for us to appreciate the intricate creation and physical laws that govern them. These heavenly bodies operate so perfectly and obey Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's command so precisely that the whole system has been running seamlessly for millions of years.